Meghan Markle once again got snubbed in another iconic cover. Meghan Markle wasn't included in a PR mouthpiece People magazine's 50th anniversary issue, which includes on its cover Hollywood legends like Oprah Winfrey, Jennifer Aniston and Michael J. Fox. The stars were also joined by Drew Barrymore, Viola Davis, Dwayne Johnson, Nicole Kidman, John Legend, Matthew McConaughey, Serena Williams and Reese Witherspoon, and a corgi with a crown. Of course, Meghan wasn't included. She can't hold a candle to any of these celebrities, including the adorable corgi. Sorry Meghan, you're just not that important. Jennifer Aniston is no Meghan fan, so people told Meghan that won't be necessary when she called about being on the cover. It's unfortunate that even Oprah didn't offer Meghan a place on the cover. New reports have now emerged suggesting that Oprah has grown disillusioned with Meghan after uncovering troubling details that raise doubts about the truthfulness of Meghan's claims during the interview. Sources close to Oprah reveal that in the month following the interview, she delved deeper into verifying some of Meghan's more shocking allegations. Upon further investigation, inconsistencies and contradictory evidence to key parts of Meghan's story came to light. For instance, it's reported that Oprah commissioned her own team to scrutinise Meghan's assertion that palace officials refused to help when she expressed suicidal thoughts while pregnant. However, Oprah's team struggled to substantiate this claim as no formal request for help could be found on record. Additionally, Oprah heard rumours from other royal sources that it was actually Meghan who made Catherine cry before the wedding due to a disagreement over a dress fitting for Princess Charlotte. Contradicting Meghan's account. Kate allegedly told friends that she was left in tears by Meghan's demanding behaviour and attitude. As Oprah dug deeper, she discovered that several key palace staff members whom Meghan claimed had mistreated her were no longer in the roles described by Meghan at the times of the alleged incidents. Their employment records contradicted Meghan's timeline of events. Furthermore, important context seemed to be missing from Meghan's accounts. It was revealed that it's standard protocol for all royal brides to have someone present for dress fittings, in case adjustments are needed, making the argument with Kate seem less unreasonable. As Oprah pieced together this new information, she reportedly became concerned that Meghan may have exaggerated parts of a story or presented an edited version of events. Oprah felt misled and used by Meghan to further a personal agenda against the royals. Their once friendly relationship quickly turned icy when Oprah confronted Meghan with the findings during a heated phone call shortly after the interview aired. Tensions escalated further when Harry and Meghan announced lucrative business deals with Netflix and Spotify worth over $100 million, shortly after the interview's hype died down. Oprah viewed this as the ultimate betrayal and saw it as evidence that Meghan had used her for publicity and headlines to launch the couple's new royal careers in America. Since then, Oprah and Meghan have had no communication, and Oprah has declined invitations to attend events with the Sussexes. Their friendship imploded within months as scepticism grew regarding Meghan's credibility and intentions surrounding the royal interview. Sources indicate that Oprah now regrets giving Meghan such a prominent platform without conducting thorough fact-checking. She worries about enabling someone who appears more interested in self-promotion than in the whole truth. Ironically, Oprah's association with Meghan has damaged her own reputation. Her exhaustive examination of Meghan's claims revealed inconsistencies and missing pieces that shattered the trust between them. Oprah now joins the growing number of those who believe that Meghan may not be the entirely truthful victim she portrayed herself to be. Only time will tell if more truth comes to light. And that wraps up the breakdown of how Oprah Winfrey severed ties with Meghan Markle over apparent lies and deceit.